Welcome to Cola Break. I just cleansed the palate because I just tried a dill pickle flavored peanuts. If you check that out, you'll see the link in the description. But today, it's going to be a different taste test. We're going to go with Clancy's, which is um, Aldi brand. Crinkle cut pulled pork flavored kettle chips. That is a mouthful. Do I like pulled pork? Of course I do. Do I like kettle chips? Of course I do. But together, will it make the cut? You shall see. Guys, like the video, comment down below. Have you tried these pulled pork flavored kettle chips? If so, how'd you like it? And what's your favorite flavored kettle chips? Guys, please subscribe, fist bump guys. And of course, please don't forget to share this video. It really does help a lot. Without further ado, let's get into the taste test. Whenever there's a, a little saying on the bag, I usually like to read it out. So, the unfortunately, the pickle peanuts did not have any description, but this one does. Let's read it. Clancy's Crinkle Cut Pulled Pork Flavored Kettle Chips. We all love snacks, but getting a good one isn't easy. You need ingredients, lots of flavor, and some big, satisfying crunches. At Clancy's, we have all that and more. All you need to do is grab your favorite bag and go. Okay. Time to open up the chips. Aroma. I smell aroma. <laughs> I was. Smells are so deceiving. Uh, do I smell chips? Yes, I do. Um, it smells kind of like barbecue smell, but not barbecue. Like, it's not like you get the barbecue chips, the flavor chips, and these are, you know, these are pulled pork flavored. Has a little, the barbecue smell to it, so we'll just go with that. Okay. Time to, I just went ahead and poured the chips. Here's a good size chip. There you go. There's the seasoning. Okay. Wish me luck. What shall I say? What shall I say about this? It's like pulled pork had a baby. And that baby was just left, it was left in a cave. And then someone found that baby, took him home to take care of that baby. But that baby, it was, it was nothing, nothing to be done. You, you had to, you had to just, it just, it's festering. It's, it's not quite right. You know when you leave something out in the sun and, well, it doesn't taste quite right. Well, these, this is one of those things. This is a second bite against my better judgment. It's like it has a like a like a aftertaste that's that kind of 
goes into your into your body and it's like why why did I do that you know disappointment disappointment now if you love if you love barbecue potato chips you'll probably like this it has like a stronger flavor to it and I think it's a little overpowering on the cola break meter one out of five Womp, womp, womp. The, the crunch is good on the potato chip flavor. Just wasn't, wasn't what, what I was expecting. I was just expecting, you know, you know, when you bite into a pulled pork sandwich and it's just like, oh yeah, hot and juicy and all that. Didn't get that here. I appreciate you sticking with me for this video. Thanks so much, and thanks for taking a cola break with me.